So that was the cast of Wicked. With one short day. We got there eventually, didn't we? Yes. <laughs> Although I think we do need more people to get their requests in, don't we? Definitely. Definitely. Just pick up the phone that's near your bed. It's attached to a monitor. When you pick up the phone, as if by magic, a little icon will appear. You will come through to us in the studio. It's incredible. It's like magic, but better and free. So that's fine. Just come through to us in the studio. At the moment, we've got quite a lot going on in the county with regard to the local elections. And obviously, you guys being part of the Youth Forum, that's very linked in with you know local government. Have you been involved at all? Well, I ha- I um, I'm off to the count on Friday at the Ketchum Conference Centre, sort of I don't know representing you for them yeah. being there, um, but unfortunately um, I missed the deadline to register for voting, Oops. so I won't be voting Thursday. Um, I'm not quite 18 yet, so I can't vote either. Oh. <laughs> but um, we do get to meet with a lot of councillors and then like prospective councillors and things like that. Like I know that like, before we've met with like. We meet with the mayors, but we have met with the actual full council and everything like that as well. So we are kind of involved. So whoever gets elected will get to meet the youth forum in some shape or form as well. So well. it's nice to get involved. So it's it's good to take an interest to know that who we'll be seeing yep. next year. <laughs> and you've you've then got kind of the inside scoop, haven't you? Any gossip? Not this year. It's all right. I'm only not not this year. Sinead, Sinead's the little gossip monger in the corner. Not this year, but last year. I can't tell you. They used to stink of garlic all of the time. That's not what she said. Not at all. But that you definitely had a little glint in your eye. Do you enjoy politics? I like the fact that like I think it's good to take an interest in it because it kind of if you don't have an interest, you can't complain or you can't like have an opinion. I don't think so. I think. Yeah. I like to take an interest in kind of what's going on around, like more locally than nationally, just purely because I live in Northampton, I kind of want to know what's happening, which is part of the reason I joined the Youth Forum, because although it's not political, it is good to know what's happening around the town. But um, I do think politics is important. I think more young people should exercise the fact that they can vote, because a lot of people are like, no, I don't really want to. And then... They moan about what's happening. Definitely, <laughs> and 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 like you say, maybe don't feel like you are all that involved in politics, but you want to know what's going on around the town and things. Well, that that is politics. And yeah. when you get you know annoyed at working full time and paying taxes and things like that, you know things annoy you. When you look around, and you're like, well, actually, I could do something if I you know just kind of cared a little bit more to find out about it. And I suppose as well, young people. I don't think it's much of a secret that young people don't get the best press. We hear about, you know, kids loitering around and hoodies and things like that. There's a lot of, I think, stereotyping around younger people. Yeah, like, um, but like with the Youth Forum, we're like aiming, part of it is aiming to change the stereotypes. Like one of the ex-Youth Forum members is now an apprentice to one of the MPs in Northampton. So it kind of emphasised what she wanted to do within the town and she wanted to take more of an interest and now she's working with one of the MPs and we've got other ex-youth forum members that are kind of in high level political parties as well just like so it gives people more of an interest in what is going on locally and then when they move away they want to take more of an interest it's what's going on in their new town so I think it does I think we as a as young people can change our own like the way people view us I think we don't have to be a hoodie we can be an educated young person and I know that from uh, we've you know I've interviewed people from the youth forum several times and you guys actually for every time I've walked past a group of people and thought oh no you're the future of this country (laughs) I then meet you guys and I think yes (laughs) do you know what it's all right I think actually we're in safe hands (laughs) Because the youth forum members are obviously interested and care. And there are a lot of young people. It's not all that long ago that I was a young person. A couple of years ago, that title was stripped from me. It was painful, I can tell you. But, you know, you don't have to be in your 50s to be interested in what's going on in your local surroundings, do you? 